Howdy folks, that was the theme from uh, the show Stranger Things from Netflix. Yeah, <laughs> because this is a tool Monday and we're going to do a tool review, but it's a stranger tool so that they can go to worlds where you and I can't go and they can see things and record things. So it's a sort of an interest, a little different, interesting tool. It's the DS300 and from Depths Tech right here. Yeah, and it's a camera with up to 1080, so got pretty good resolution. 16 and a half feet of cable, so it can go down through something and take a look around. And uh, has a L six LED uh, lights built into the little tiny camera. The camera can fit through a half inch hole. So you can imagine, like take a spark plug out of your car, put the camera in, you can take a look at the top of your piston, stuff like that. Just a lot of different weird applications around the tool shop kind of thing, but it can do a lot of, th it's, just, it's just a lot of crazy things that they're handy for. But this one here, the price is phenomenal. For the quality of what you're looking at, it's a great price. And it comes with a TF or micro SD card, uh, 32 gig. So you can record whatever it is you're looking at, sit down at a computer and take another, you know, look at it and, you know, say, okay, this is what we got to do. But what a awesome, interesting idea. In fact, I was looking this morning at my compressor <clears throat> and, uh, putting the camera down inside the tank to take, sort of take a look and see how much rust we have in there. The, the news was not very good, but it was expected. It was like, yeah, it's rusting in there and it's, you know, yeah, not good. So here's what comes in the box and here's the actual unit itself. Uh, I've got a lot of lighting in the studio here, so apologize if it uh, looks a little bright or a little strange. Uh, first thing you can do is you charge it up using a USB port they give you a cable supplied to plug in here. Also, they have a micro SD card, or as they call them, a TF card, 32 gigabytes. So it can record video and or pictures. And we'll just power it up to start with. Now, I've got the camera just kind of loose right now, so it's going to look a little weird because we're going to look at the box that's <clears throat> on the table here. But, yeah, there's the actual box. It's like a camera, so you can hold it in your right hand. And you can go to video or pictures. Uh, you also have a menu. Right now it's set for 1080p, which is, you know, a good resolution. The screen is fairly bright, so you can see really well. Let's just take a look at my hand, for example, coming across there. And it has another feature. Because it's 16 and a half feet of cable, uh, you have a little zoom button here, so you can actually zoom in on something. If you're inspecting a piece of equipment, and you can change the angle of the camera, and also you can, uh, oops, just a second here, <laughs> we're formatting, and we're looking back. The camera has a, a dual function, so it can look around side to side, as well as looking uh, straight ahead. And just a second here, there we go, straight ahead again. Uh, uh, from the, now we have a split screen, so we can have the side camera's views and, and again, I'll, I'll just put my hand up in front of the side of the camera here. And it also, of course, you can have just, you know, the other side and, or again, we'll just look straight ahead here at the, it's a professional industrial endoscope. So it really has really good features for what it can do. Also, we can take a picture, which we just did, or we can start a video up and record to that 32 gigabyte card. Sorry about the shaking, the little bit of handshake here is me, not the not anything else wrong really. But uh, you can also uh, turn the lights down a little bit here if, you, if it's too, if the camera's too bright, which it was right now. I, I had the lights on a little bit. Uh, there you go, you can turn the lights way up. If you're, if it's a dark area you're looking into, you know, anything where you've, you know, look at the size of the camera here, fellas. I mean, look at this thing, there, there's the actual, uh, you know, the camera with the lights on it, and it is absolutely tiny, so it can fit through easily a small hole. I would almost say a 3 8 but I would say drill a half-inch hole into something, and you could drop this thing through if you wanted to look inside a wall or something crazy like that, but also if you're looking inside your car. Let's talk, talk about the specifications a little bit on this little guy. This uh, screen here is a 4.3-inch uh, LCD screen. It has, uh, the camera's diameter is said to be 0.22 inch, so theoretically it's about a quarter of an inch in size for the probe. It has six LED lights built into the camera, which is facing forward, but it can also work side to side. It has a best focal length of 1.9 to 
3.9 inches. So anywhere from about two to four inches is your focal area where you're gonna be, you know, in, uh, in range. Also, you've got a two megapixel uh, photo resolution and your video is at 1080p at 25 frames a second, which, you know, I think that's really decent. The cable length that comes with this camera is 16.5 feet and it also has a DC uh, 5 volt power supply but like I said this has got a lithium battery built in so you can just charge it up and makes it totally portable so you can take it to the job site and use it you can run it off with just one hand you don't need two hands on the camera and it's fairly light and portable and oh did I mention this is waterproof yeah the camera is said to be waterproof so it has a lot of functions. The price on this little guy here is actually really, really good right now. And I believe, I've been told, we're gonna to have a discount code or something for this if you wanna pick one up. It's handy for if you can't get into something and you can't even get your head in there or maybe even a cell phone, you can probably get this guy in there to take a look around if there's a question. Whether it be a transmission or see inside an engine or inside a pipe or anything you wanna inspect, you can use this this little camera and it will do a whiz bang job for you. Just for an example of another situation, I'm going to take a look at an electric motor I have here that is, uh, I want to just take a quick look at the windings and see the condition they're in. So I just put the camera in there to look around for a second, but I just wanted to give you guys like an example of uh, what the electric motor situation looks like. And so there's the installation and you know, everything looks pretty good but uh, the camera allows me to go in there and take a look around. How cool is that? So there's the box. <laughs> here's, the, here's the unit out of the box. And <clears throat> this is what we were just looking at. Like I said, 16 feet of cable. The other thing, I don't know if I mentioned it, uh, it's, it's a stiff cable, which you can actually bend to shape or something like that if you need to get into something really strange or like you go around a corner or something like that. Around the house, you might not think it would be that uh, advantageous to have something, a tool of this nature, but you know, how many times have you got into something and it was like, man, if I just had a little camera to see around the corner or see down in there to see what's going on, it would help me. And uh, unlike uh, the Wallbot or some of those other <clears throat> cameras that are on the market, this one here has side to side and forward and so you can get in there with the lights and you can see what's going on visually actually you know get a look at something uh, we had a line here in the house that you know had a problem and a wall bot would just show well you know there's a piece of pipe there but psh, you know, that's all it's going to tell you this thing here went down and take a look at it and say okay there's a crack in that pipe and we need to do a repair on this or replace the line and uh, so this answers, you know, the question. Plus, like I said, it's waterproof. Uh, it comes with the cable, the 32 gigabyte card, uh, so and USB chargeable, so you can charge her up and run her for the day. So it has quite a few specifications. They tell me the price is going to be really good. I was shocked at the price. It really was. It was like that's all they want for that. Wow, that's a pretty good little camera, you know, for professional industrial use. It's like, oh, wow. Okay, so this week that's what we're doing uh, is this tool here. Usually we do our tool reviews on Thursdays. We will have something on Thursday, of course, but it's uh, we're going to get to this thing too. And I guess probably a lot of people are wondering right now, is he going to give that away? Probably. I think so. <laughs> yeah, I have to keep watching to find out. Because uh, right now we have something else to give away, but that'll be, like I said, Thursday show. So Monday, I uh, wanted to show you guys that, and uh, also down in the description below, we will put the coupon or the code, whatever, to get you a discount price, hopefully a really good price, for this particular unit. And uh, it's one of those things you add to your workshop, and if you get into a tight situation and you want to look at something, this will allow you to do it. So, what can I tell you? Hey, thank you so much for watching Coffee and Tools, and please like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, and I'm out of here, uh, over and out.